Thousands of Connecticut high school seniors will be getting their diplomas next month. Graduation rates are climbing to an all-time high, according to new stats from the state education department. But there is still work to be done. Chief political correspondent Mark Davis has the numbers. So you guys do offsets all the time. The high school seniors in this class at East Hartford High School are among the approximately 35,000 Connecticut kids that will graduate in the next few weeks. Like New Haven and Waterbury, East Hartford is among the state's alliance districts, school districts with the highest need for improvement. Here, the improvement in graduation rate has been dramatic, up nearly 15% in the past five years. East Hartford High's graduation rate was 94.6%. Matt Ryan is principal here and says the key to success is knowing every kid's story. He says you need to know why a kid isn't coming to school and try to work out the problems with specialized help. Your system is, you know, covers 85% of your kids. The 15% that need the extra attention, you have to have a system to give them that extra attention. New Haven and New London schools have seen about an 11 point increase in graduation rates over the past four years. Waterbury, another alliance district, has only seen about a three and a half point gain. We are so impressed with the improvements in the alliance districts and in the ed reform districts, which have been our fastest moving districts in improving the graduation rates. For Governor Malloy, who toured here today, the fact that the state school districts most in need of improvement increased their graduation rates to nearly 78 percent became something to celebrate. This is the fifth year in a row that Connecticut high school graduation rates have gone up, and so has participation in the scholastic aptitude tests. In East Hartford, Mark Davis, News 8.